The Adjust to Slice Mandolin Slicer gives you three thickness options, thin, medium, and thick, making it simpler than ever to bring a variety of fruits and vegetables to your table. Let me show you how it works. Simply set the blade to the desired thickness with this slicing knob. Then you can either hold the slicer at an angle against a cutting board or rest it over a bowl. The many side grooves allow the mandolin slicer to fit over a variety of bowls. Carefully slide the food over the blade a few times to get a flat base. Now, secure the food with the finger guard and slide the food over the blade to get perfect slicing.
This is a quick video demo to show you how to use your Briefton's Quick Push Food Chopper model, BRQP02. Please take a few moments to watch it before using the chopper. Components. Your chopper comes with the following components. A lid that houses a blade. Pusher teeth on the pusher which can be detached from the lid for easy cleaning. Two more blades of various sizes. A cleaning comb. A keep fresh lid which can be put on the container to keep boots fresh for longer. Blade types. The chopper comes with three blades. 6mm by 6mm square cuts. 13mm by 13mm square cuts. 19mm by 19mm square cuts. How to use. To chop foodstuffs, please follow these steps. Put the quick push food chopper on an even, flat surface. Place the lid securely on top of the container. Make sure that the lid's hinge locks into the container's hinge for secure operation. If necessary, remove the existing blade from the blade slot. Choose your desired blade and insert it into its position. Push down firmly on the blade until it levels with the basin. Cut large onions into halves or quarters. For harder veggies, cut them into thin pieces first. Place the vegetable on the blade. Make sure that the vegetable to be chopped stays entirely within the blade area, otherwise you might have difficulty chopping it. Put a hand flat on lid and push down quickly. The keep fresh lid can be used to store foods away in the fridge. How to clean. Use the provided cleaning comb to remove debris in between the lid's pressure teeth or blades. Optionally, use a kitchen brush to clean the blades. The lid's pressure can be removed for thorough cleaning if required. To remove it, turn it by 90 degrees and to lift it up. To restore the lid's pressure after cleaning, position it at a 90 degree angle over the lid and push down on it until it locks into the two hinges on the lid. I hope this video has been helpful to you. Thanks for watching and happy chopping!